Hey, welcome to Sound Karma Fast Tracks episode 34. You know, there are so many talented artists all around the world and more people need to hear their stuff. But you know, for the most part, the music business pretty much shuts down for about eight weeks during the holidays. So things have been a little slow the last couple months. But we're into the new year now, things are picking back up, and we're getting a lot of new stuff in now. So in just a second, we're going to preview five new songs in under five minutes. We'll play a short clip of each track, but we have links to the full videos below if you want to watch the whole thing. Every song in this episode was sent to us, and anyone can send us a track for a future episode. Whether you're an artist, or a promoter, or a fan, just use the link below. And be sure to subscribe to our channel so you don't miss any cool new indie music. All right, in this episode, we're featuring the brand new track from Eternal Frequency. They say this song screams female empowerment and refusing to be pigeonholed in the industry. It's called Step Up. It just premiered on January 7th. We'll preview the new video. We featured Kachel Coughlin's solo stuff last year. He holds his own when it comes to pure musical talent. But during the pandemic, he did something really cool. He teamed up with Garrett Jackknife Lee, who's worked with bands like U2, R.E.M., The Killers, and Snow Patrol. They teamed up for a project called Telefiche. We'll preview their new track called Falun Gong Dancer. And they brought in bass maestro Ja Wobble for this one. It's really, really cool. You know, you'd be insane to try to cover an iconic song from White Zombie. Sixth Century has pulled off an amazing remake of More Human Than Human. Rabbit Hood is a hard rock band from Norway. We've got their brand new song called Spiteful. But we'll begin with brand new song from Tom Ticka. He's got a bunch of musical projects going on pretty much all the time, like his work with The Impersonators and Carmen Gray. This, though, is a solo track. It's already gone to number 15 on the Canadian iTunes pop chart. Dude is super talented. Wait, you'll see this. This is Tom Ticka by 2022. 